guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl a marie don't forget to like comment and subscribe and click the notification bell if you're original diamond hey boo i see you so today we have a exciting video for you guys so maybelline y'all know how i feel about maybelline maybelline came out with seven new lipsticks that are supposedly are able to be worn by many different shade tones different shades of people so new sensational lip colors and it maybelline claims made for all lipsticks by color sensational it claims to been have tested on 50 diverse skin tones so with that being said i seen too much mouth here on youtube do hers and i seen another youtuber but i don't really watch her that much so i i really don't remember her name i decided you know what let me go to the store pick these bad boys up and try them for myself so hopefully you guys are interested in this video you guys know i barely wear lipsticks anymore i'm more of a liquid lipstick lover now so hopefully this brings me back to the lipstick side of the game you guys know i love me some maybelline so i'm looking at the website now and it says discover color sensational made for all by maybelline satin and matte lipsticks in purple pink and red universal shades that complement every skin tone and they do retail for $7.49 a piece but at my Walmart I found them for $5.49 <clears throat> for $5.49 I believe on Maybelline's website you can use the app to try on the lips to see if it complements you and it says satisfaction guaranteed and it's a game changer so I want to put Maybelline to the test so we're gonna jump right into it I did go ahead and wipe my liquid lipstick off I'm not doing no lip liner or anything like that so we're just gonna go ahead and jump right into it the first one is gonna be 373 moth for me and it looks like this but the shade looks like this and I am gonna do like the swatches for you guys as well as try them on my lips very pretty nude color oh that is pretty Okay, here is what my for me looks like. I'm not mad at it. I think if you put on a brown lip liner, this would actually work. And what I just noticed is that you will be able to tell the packaging between the satin and the matte by the top. <laughs> The top of this one, this one is a satin lip because it's a shiny top. And I'm going to tell you what I mean once I move on to the next ones. So the next one is going to be 370 Spice for me. And this one also is a satin. Oh, they smell so good. And here's what it looks like. It's more of an orangey brown. Beautiful brick brown type of color. Oh, I am feeling this color. I can actually see myself wearing this during the summer or during fall. This is very pretty. I wouldn't have thought to pick up anything like this, but it is pretty to me. I'm not mad at it. All right, so the next color is going to be 376 pink for me. Now this one I know for sure I'm probably going to like. This one is a satin one also and it looks like this. This is almost like a dusty rose color so I think I'm going to love this one. Okay this one is more sheer than anything so let's try it. Okay, I feel like this color will be my my new go-to color. Like, pink for me is really pretty. It takes a, just a little bit to build up. But once you get it there, you're good. Like, this is pretty. 
This is something you can wear on its own. So the next color is going to be 379 Fuchsia for me. Now I'm not going to lie you guys. This color scares me. It is one of a like a fuchsia fuchsia color. But I thought of this as a fall color as well or a summer color. But it's very pretty. Very pretty. I honestly will wear this. I will wear this on its own just like this. It's not too bright, but it shows up just enough to make your skin tone look really, really good. Like, I will wear this without any lip liner or anything on its own. Hmm. I'm shocked. I know I could wear this by itself, like... And won't have no problems. I wouldn't have never guessed though. I wouldn't have guessed that this would be something I would wear on its own. Okay, you guys. Now the next one is going to be red for me in number 382. This one actually says matte on it. But as you could tell, the packaging is different. So you could tell the difference between the packaging. And it's seven new shades. And this is the only matte lipstick Maybelline came out with so here we are and this is red for me 382 Ooh, even though it's matte it's still creamy oh I would pair this with night moth from Mac lip liner oh my god and marry the two together and make a beautiful ombre This could be a red. Ooh, I just looked up into the monitor. This red I would wear. This is a red I would throw in my purse and wear on an everyday basis. And it makes my teeth look extra white. Oh my gosh. Maybelline. I like this. I really truly like this color. everyday type of look right here boom okay so the next one we have is 385 ruby for me and this is a satin lipstick oh but she's gorgeous oh she's pretty so we're gonna make this the last swatch over here oh she is really ruby she's darker than red for me but she's still opaque like red for me. Like she's a little bit darker. Oh shoot. Maybelline. Wow you guys. Look at this. You guys. This is pretty. Oh and pigmented. These are nice and pigmented. I could wear this all day too. Like, last but not least, hopefully, we are dipping off into 388 Plum for me. And this is like a true fall color. Oh, I know I'm gonna like this one too. You guys, I'm a fan, and now I'm a firm believer. Look at this color. This is amazing. I love this color as well. Just look at it. So 
So Maybelline has me as a firm believer right now. I thought I should do this lip swatch just so you guys if are my skin tone or around my skin tone, what each shade would look like on you as well as me trying it out for myself. I can say I think these type of lipsticks, especially the new shade range, I love that Maybelline made seven staple shades that could fit anybody's skin tone. I love that. And that was well put together and it's able to match any skin tone. They tested over 50 shades of people and they supposedly matched them. I can honestly say yes, they match me. They complement my skin tone. And there's like three shades that I thought that I would have never picked up. And I probably still to this day would have never picked them up until I seen Too Much Mouth do this type of video. So therefore it made me wanna go pick it up. And Too Much Mouth is like a couple of shades darker than me. So I was like, well, if those colors look good on her, then they should look good on me. So it made me go and pick them up. So Maybelline did a really good job with these new sensational lip lipsticks. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts. Have you picked these lipsticks up? Are you going to pick these lipsticks up? And if so, which shade do you think you would pick up? Like I said before, I will put these in my purse, in my makeup bag, in my purse and pull out whichever one that I feel like I should wear in that moment because all seven shades match me just fine. I would love for you guys to go and follow me on Instagram. My handle is always down below in the hot box. Make sure to at least go and like this Maybelline picture on Instagram and tag Maybelline for me. And I'll see you guys in the next one.